Heidi. Welcome back with Cooking with Nana. Today I am going to teach you how to make a nam ki lui. It's called, in English we might probably call um, sawdust rice salad. But in Lao they would call it nam ki lui. Okay, the main ingredients was the dry rice. This is jasmine rice khao jiao. So the jasmine rice, you have, it's cooked, and then you just take it and um, 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 leave it in the plate or something and then let it dry. Um, so it will be hard like this. Okay, once it roasts, like, you know how you roast um, khao kua, like um, roast the rice? You can um, put on low heat and with your pot, you just roast it and it turns brown. You don't want over um, brown your rice, it won't taste that good. Just like a medium light color. Once it's done, I um, I let it cool it down and I blend it. I use the coffee grinder to blend it so it's like a dust. Very fine dust. Like that. And then my other ingredients that I have would be my MSG um, I put one tablespoon, it's an option if you want to put one tablespoon of salt, vinegar, one fourth cup of vinegar, and half cup of the pickled garlic juice. And then I use three of this pickle. I cut and slice the, the skin. So, um, and then one third cup of fish sauce. So I have nam som, laka and dong and pak tiam, nam man laka ton man, and then nam pa, and then I would have. You can use bell pepper, um, the green, the red, you know, mak pet and soy julienne. It has a nice um Green onion, cilantro. This is the last herb, and then my other, the meat. I would have um, humu. You just ear um, boil it, and rent, um, when you boil it with salt, let it cook. Rinse it with cold water. Once it's cooled down, slice it thin. Some people like to use pork skin. You can. Um, some people, you know, don't want to use pork skin. They can use the pork ear. It tastes good. So, and then. I have my water boiling. That's what we need to. We're gonna make the sauce now. This is my hot water. Have to be boiled. My water is boiled. You can boil it in a pot and stuff. Since I already have this, I'm gonna use um, two cup of hot water. Okay, and then I'm gonna add. A half cup of my sugar. My salt. One tablespoon. MSG. One tablespoon. It's the options. Remember, if you want to put MSG, you can. And a fish sauce. One third cup of fish sauce. This is going to be the broth to mix the the rice until you all dissolve and then we're gonna use one fourth cup of vinegar okay. once now we're gonna taste the the broth the water it depends how how you like it do you want more out sweet you can add more sugar if you want more a um, um, little bit sour add vinegar you want a little bit salty you can add a little bit more um, fish sauce or salt mm. I'm gonna add a little bit more sugar because I like mine a little bit sugar so I use half cup of sugar you know what another half because I like mine sweet so a total of all is gonna be for me one cup like I say, you can use half cup. What I use, it depends. You taste your broth, how you want it sweet, sour, 
and saltiness. Once it's all dissolved, you taste it. Mm. Okay, I like the way it is. So I'm going to set this aside and start going to mix my rice. And make the broth set aside, let it cool. So I'm going to use the pork ear. A lot of people do a different way, and this is the way my mom have taught me. So remember the garlic, the pickled garlic. My mom likes to use the juice of it. Um, she likes the smell of it, the taste of it. You know, if you can't find this, you don't have to use it, but my mom just like the way it is. So we're going to mix the garlic into the pig ear. Okay. Now I'm going to add the rice. I use two cup of the rice. Okay. And you stir it until it's all into the pig ear. So now I'm going to add the broth in here that I mix. I'm going to use one half cup first. You don't have to cut, you just like um, mix it with your hand. And it will, when it gets, it gets all mixed and dry, it will, the rice will puff it, puff it up. I'm going to add another half. Okay. Okay, we're going to taste it. Hmm. Now I'm going to add the, um, the pickled um, garlic in here. Like I said, people like to put garlic, people don't. It depends. You know, a lot of people do different way. It looks wet like this. Once it gets all dry up, all the ingredients together, it will become puffy. Like the rice will um, cook with the broth. And I'm going to add the pepper in here. Just use your hand to um, stir it. You don't have to... Um, Squeeze it like mokan kadai, you know. Yeah, after it's done, konman, just konman, and then it will be puffy. Let me hang like konla kau, man kasi an fung kun. Okay, then I will add my last ingredients, my vegetable, my green onion and cilantro. To tilo ko si sai an. หัวปักบัวน้ำมันผักหอมป้อมคนเข้ากันซีมมันฟุ้งขึ้นอีสิเพนจะอยากใส่หอมป้อมใส่อย่างใส่อีกก็ได้แล้วเขาซีมเบิงอืมแซ่บละโซอ่ะวันนี้เค้ามีติดขาดแล้วมันกระซิบพุ่งขึ้นให้มันเซฟฟอร์ลูเบตแล้วมันกระซิบพุ